guy beside me is listening to some Bon Jovi, man. He's cranking it. Whoa, we're halfway there. To be honest, uh, I miss some of you guys. Oh my God. What's going on, you beautiful people? It has been a while. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Ride of a Lifetime. If this is your first time here, please consider subscribing. I think as of right now, I have, I think it's like 358 subscribers. And uh, yeah, I've had a couple in just the past couple days, even though I, I haven't posted a video. It is, it's been a while, guys. It has been a while since, uh, since I made a video for you guys. Lots to catch you guys up on. And the reasons why I haven't posted a video in, a, in almost two weeks. Well, yeah, I was supposed to post a video Wednesday and that didn't happen. And I think this video is going to come out uh, later today, which is uh, Monday as of recording this video. But yeah, just kind of want to tell you guys what's been going on, why I haven't posted a video in a second. And uh, yeah, so we've had a couple things going on. Me physically, I've had some uh, some challenges. I've, I've definitely had some... Um, I've had a couple pinched nerves in my back that kind of vary between like two different spots in my back and it just makes it hard to ride sometimes. Another thing that's really been bothering me is my wrist. So my left hand, I don't know what I what I did to it, um, but I uh, definitely screwed something up. And then uh, while I was trying to recover and you know do that, I was riding my bike because it was the only vehicle I had to ride for a second. I was riding my bike to go give something to somebody and uh, I had only been to their house like one time and I had missed the turn. So I was going uphill and tried to make a u-turn and pulled into somebody's like driveway to kind of like make the turn wider and uh, when I did that and started coming back downhill I didn't uh, let my clutch out enough so I didn't have enough speed to keep the turn going and the bike started to tip over and uh, I put my left foot down just to kind of hold myself up but then it started to tip even more yeah it started to tip a little bit more and I kind of lost control of it and I put all the weight of the bike on just my left hand and my left arm and so I was holding up a 500 pound bike with just my left hand and uh, I kept it up but my arm paid in the process uh, I heard a heard a crunch and I was like oh well that can't be good so quite unfortunate but uh, it is what it is it happens so uh, yeah I had it in like a little not cast but like one of those uh, those little bands and stuff and I kept it pretty immobilized for a couple days and um, I rode my car for the weekend and that kind of helped a lot but I was like yeah I haven't posted a video in a while so uh, we need to kind of get on here and talk about some things so yeah that uh, physically that's pretty much all that's been going on other than that I've been super busy doing so many different things um, I had church going on and uh, Easter service and Easter uh, family dinner and that kind of thing so really been pulled in a bunch of different directions and work's been crazy we've done a lot of remodeling at where I work so I've been helping with that and painting and oh man it's just uh it's just really been uh dragging me down physically so uh but uh it's all good things so all things that I like to do but um making videos for you guys is another one of my favorite things to do and uh, I neglected it for a week and I kind of I kind of regret that, to be honest. Uh, I miss some of you guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus, I need to pull over. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Man, I can't believe I kept that up. Ugh. Did you guys see that? <laughs> Man, I've never had that happen before. <sighs> I'm glad I'm recording on another angle, but... Man, is this thing still recording? Yeah, the cable's in and everything, so I'm gonna. Yeah, it's still recording. Jeez, man, that was insane! <laughs> wow, I'm trying to put my I'm trying to put my camera back in without breaking the mount because I've broken so many of these mounts. Hold up, I will be back momentarily. <sighs> All right, we're back. Oh my gosh, that was. Uh... What's up guys? That was literally insane. I'm in the middle of like really crazy traffic and uh, yeah, my I hit the piece that holds the GoPro in place. I need to have it to where maybe I put some like tape on it or something. I've never done that before so that was uh, that was a little nerve wracking. <laughs> 
So, uh, yeah, anyway, I forgot what I was talking about, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's definitely not a good thing. <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah, I remember where I was at. Actually, I'm going to get off the bike. <laughs> I'm getting off the bike for two seconds so I can <laughs> get my bearings back. But, uh, yeah, I've also been pretty busy doing a bunch of different things, just church and all that kind of stuff. I also got my uh, saddlebag mounts. Um, I did get the built well uh, saddlebags, and those are really cool. I also got my luggage rack, so um, I'll put up a picture right now. But yesterday, I kind of put everything on there, went for a little ride just to kind of test drive how much the weight difference was and uh, the saddlebags were completely empty so that was something but yeah the luggage rack held up really nice and uh, my saddlebags they don't mount to anything so I have this underneath the uh, underneath the uh, luggage rack there also got my tank bag and then I also have a Burley brand bag that'll go right right up there so it's actually gonna be like a backrest for me which is kind of cool I didn't plan it that way but it'll work out who man that was scary <laughs> all right now let's get back on the bike. But yeah, uh, yesterday I did put everything on my bike just to kind of see how it was and how it felt the with the weight difference and that kind of thing. So lots of traffic today. Um, but, uh, but yeah, I put everything on my bike and I went for about like maybe a 45 minute ride just around to kind of see how the weight difference was. And um, I went with my buddy Jesse because if you guys don't know, in like, I think it's like four or five days, uh, the Life of Birch uh, ride is happening. So in about three or four days, uh, the uh, Life of Birch subscriber meetup is happening. I have my buddy Jesse who's coming with me. Um, I mentioned it in one of my previous videos that he might be coming with us. So, uh, so uh, yeah, lots of people riding today. It's kind of nice out. It's uh, not too hot, so people are riding. But yeah, so uh, my buddy Jesse is coming on the trip with me. Uh, he had to get uh, a lot of things done to his bike and uh, to kind of get it ready for the trip. Just like me, I, I had a lot of stuff that I had to do, uh, but his was more so with the bike itself, not um, like installing parts and that kind of thing. So he was just like making sure that everything was okay and that the trip was going to happen. So that's why we went on a little ride yesterday to kind of see how well his bike would perform. He's got about a 20 year old bike. So, um, kind of wanted to see if he would actually even be able to make the trip. So it looks like he's going to be able to make the trip and, uh, yeah, it's going to be super fun. And, uh, I also have, uh, one of my buddies who lives in Washington DC. Um, cause, uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but we're going to be camping. So I have a tent that uh that we're going to be setting up and that kind of thing it looks like the weather is going to be kind of crappy going there and coming back so we'll see how uh, everything is i did order in some uh, rain pants from revzilla and my jacket has a uh, weatherproof thing in it so uh liner it has a weatherproof liner in it so we should be good there for any rain and i think the only thing that can get wet is the tank bag a little bit and the uh whatchamacallit in my uh, backpack that's the only thing that can really get uh, wet because the saddlebags have like a uh, cover that you could put over them. But yeah, so I had to do a lot of things to the bike and get it ready for uh, this trip. Uh, yesterday I did some chain maintenance on it. Kind of adjusted my chain to be in spec because it was getting really loose. So that uh, we did that. We installed the uh, saddlebag mounts. I had a whole list and I was going to make a, a video on just that. But time was not on my side. I had a lot of things to get done before I even... Uh, went on that little ride with my buddy Jesse um, just to keep, see if his bike was good. So I had to do, I had to do a lot of stuff. Put the saddlebag mounts on, put the uh, rack on, which honestly isn't that hard. But you want to make sure it looks good and it lines up with the uh, saddlebags being over, being under the luggage rack. So this guy beside me is listening to some Bon Jovi. Man, he's cranking it. <laughs> Dude, he's <is> jamming. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> yeah, boy, floor it, floor it. <laughs> oh man. Oh, it's such a good day today. Anyway, um, I plan on having probably about, I'd say, three videos, if not four, from just the subscriber meetup uh, with Birch. So, one of the videos. Uh, is going to be a cool shot because uh, I'm going to have the 360 camera running the whole time 
and I'll uh, probably upload a video to YouTube of just 360 footage and you guys can kind of scroll around if uh, you know I know that there were some people that commented on my videos that said they wanted to go but they couldn't because they couldn't get off work or whatever reason so hopefully with uh, the 360 camera running you will feel like you're kind of in the action with us so that'll be really cool and uh, my buddy Jesse I have one of my old GoPros and he's probably gonna put it on his helmet so that'll be another angle and uh, yeah but yeah I have a bunch of videos for you guys and uh, it'll be a ton of fun and I uh, I can't wait to go through and edit some of that footage and I think that'll be a lot of fun so also I think on Wednesday I'm going to go through pretty much everything I'm bringing to uh, to the subscriber meetup uh, pretty much like a rundown of everything that I'm packing everything that I'm bringing and uh, you know the ins and outs of what I got for the trip to kind of make it more comfortable for me and uh, yeah so be looking out for that video but anyway guys um, I'm probably gonna sign off here uh, I gotta be at work in 20 minutes so I gotta get turned around because my work is in the complete opposite direction but I just wanted to kind of ride around uh, kind of work my wrist a little bit to on the clutch and do that sort of things but yeah thanks to everybody who has subscribed already if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe and if you guys want to see some uh, videos specific videos from the trip uh, let me know in the comments down below so uh, I can better make content for you guys I'd love to know what you guys uh, want to see for the uh, subscriber meetup so yeah just uh, let me know and uh, I'm gonna sign off here and I will catch you guys in the next ride peace